Hello my friend, my name is Jose Cruz and welcome to Uncle Bill's favorite channel. Today I will show you how to create tabs in your application using .NET MAUI in a simple way. You see so how simple it is. So you probably noticed that we have a, uh, here in the channel a series talking about .NET MAUI. So don't forget to subscribe because we have many videos in the future. And let's go to the video. That's it. Salve. So as we are learning from the last video, let's have it away from my picture to not to have it behind that. Okay, so I will minimize it. And what we have here is a simple project, .NET, new, Maui, blah, 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 the name of the project that you want. You see super layouts here. The focus today is not to discuss about variable names or project names, okay? Let's focus on the objective here today. So first I create this folder models, okay? As we evolve this app, um, we have also the platforms folder. That's the standard one. Properties, really common standard one. The resource, I added more icons here and I changed some colors, okay? And when then we have the view models folder, that's we'll have a video in the future. So don't forget to subscribe to what also this one and learn all about the MVVM and MVU. If you are in the future, you see a card here. And we have also the folder views. That's where I have my views, okay? I have three pages here. That's my account page, my main page, and my search page. I have everything here inside of my view. So the standard app, let's have a, a look at it. Okay, yeah, as you can see, I just changed the, the colors here and it's a simple, simple project. But the objective here is should, today is not to have a simple project, to have tabs, right? So let's stop it. I, I will move it uh, behind my camera and not show enough in here right now. And let's go to the app shell. The shell is where we have the shell, right? The scope of our application. As you can see, I have my search page here. I'm as main page, this is the, um, the hold. And also I'm not going to have only one page so I can comment it or delete your tools and to have our tabs for organization I will have my tab bar okay the first thing that we need to add here is a tab bar okay now I have my tab bar what's going to be inside of this tab bar my tabs right I will create only one so inside of my tabs I want to have some definitions on my properties so let's have my title that I will call it home and also an icon, right? I can add some icons here. So icon, home, I think it's icon, G. Okay, great. I have my tab here, my home, my icon, but I need to have something inside my tab, right? I have my tab bar, I have my tab and I need to have a page inside of my tab as reference. Okay. So what I need to add here is a shell content. So let's add a shell content here as we had uh, below, right? That's commented. Shell content, close it and done. Okay. I need to specify some, um, some properties here, what I'm using for this, for this page, right? For this content. First of all is the template. So content template, data template. And now I will use my namespace to reference my viewers here. Okay, so let's use local, it's the name of my namespace. And as you can see, we have a list of um, views here. We have on the MVVM video, I will talk about uh, why main page is not appearing here, but you're already guessing, right? Yeah, so let's have it main page and that's it perfect oh you forgot one thing we need to add our hold right we want to involve this in the future i will call it the same name done we have our first tab here and let's have um, an overview about this as you can see we have one new page here that's my home is my main page not that search page anymore as you can see here below and you can see that it's a collection. We are trying to create like a Uber here or Uber is okay. So good, but where's the tab, right? You can notice that we don't have tabs here or here in the top. That's because we have only one tab. Let's create another two. Done. As you can see, I have three tabs here right now. I have my main page, I have my search page and account page. The same page in views that I have here right count page main page and search page so let's start our application to see how it's how it looks like how it looks right now great i have my list here as my main page my restaurant list and then and you can notice that i have here one tab called search 
body have here. It's just that simple page that we used it before. I'm not creating the involving the application right now, the Fox and the tapes and on the tabs. And you can see right now we have also an account that's just one button, create an alert, really simple. So as you can see, we are changing also our title here, home, search, and account. You can see it's using the title in Portuguese. I need to change it for global uh, nomenclature. Right, so we have more than one bottom tab, right? Imagine that I want to have the top tabs. How can I create it? Let's have it. Let's let's. Uh, I will show you right now. It's really really simple. On Maui, if you want to have top tabs, you just add the shell content and one on tab. Basically, that that it's really really simple. Let's create it right now. Done. What I did here, I just added the same page here. I just changed the whole, but I will delete it. But whatever. Just let's start an application, and you see that in the first tab that I will have here. I have home and three new tabs. Why we don't have nothing here? As we can see, it's just a giant space. It's because we need to add a title here, right? I, we didn't add the titles and that's why it's really weird here. But as you can see, um, let's stop it. Let's stop and add the title really fast. Done, tab one, two, and three on the my home tab. Okay, so first, as you can see, I have my tab one, tab two, and tab three having the same page as we have here below but it's completely different um, scope. Why? Because if I go to the search page, I don't have those tabs. Those tabs belongs to the first tab, okay? That's the home. Okay, Jose, but wh what if I want to change my, my tabs? I want to remove the, the tabs below. Just remove the tabs, have one tab inside of, with shell content inside of it, okay? It's really, really simple way to have it there. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and I see you in the next video.